Hello everyone, it is Sally with Planet It Simple and it's finally here you guys. We can finally move into our new July to June or 18 month planner, however long you have yours for. Mine's just a 12 month. Um, we can finally move into the new planners. First week planning in the new one. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Sorry for the glare. I just really wanted to get plenty of light. There's, I mean, it's pretty early in the day so there's a decent amount of sunlight but I wanted to make sure that it was nice and bright for you guys. So, um, I have kind of started moving and I'll show you a couple of things that I did but um, I have a name decal on its way. I don't know. I have a name decal on its way to go in here. I know, I said I was gonna do it myself but eh. <laughs> um, we're splurging this year I guess so. Anywho's, and I was really brave and I filled in this with the kids schedule for the coming year. I know, I know we have no idea what's happening with the dates and whatnot yet, but um, we'll see somewhat like this one right here is a homecoming and I, I didn't write next to it because I don't know if I need to take that off completely. I don't even know, but um, so I have the dates in. I marked paydays, which is, I mean, people are still gonna need to get paid um, in our school district. So um, I marked those with um, the outlines. I, that's why I really like using the outlines because sometimes there's other things happening on the same day as some of the paydays. So you can easily mark both. This one was a little bit tough because it was both an early release and a um, parent-teacher conference day. So that was interesting, but I only marked them through the, the um, the end of this planner. I didn't go into the next year because that'll be the next year's planner. Uh, and then I did start doing this. I had a plan for this, but this might, what I had in mind might be changing because there uh, is something on its way <laughs> that's going to be more in depth as to what this was going to be. So, um, I'm really, really focused on goals this year and that's what I really want to use my planner to really keep me in check with my goals. And so I was just really goal focused in this and um, you'll just have to see how things sh like are shaping up and are coming along as far as that goes. Um, I'll keep you in the loop, trust me. So my monthly is pretty blank right now because, spoiler alert, I have my very first monthly kit coming and um, I'm pretty excited but also really nervous about that so it's not here yet so I'll have to do a little back planning on that one and um, once I get it and so that'll be a fun little thing to try out and I'll share that with you guys too okay so this page Again, I had an idea of what I was going to do with it using goal-centric type of stuff and I was going to do a habit tracker here, but this other thing came along and so I don't know if I'm actually going to use this. So I may end up taping these pages together. I don't want a separate area for birthdays. I put that in my plan or other place, like I'll put it my month and whatever. Um, so I don't need a separate list for birthdays my goals are going to be in another place. My habits are going to be in another place. So I'm just kind of torn on what to do with this one. So yeah, not a lot of moving um, happening yet in this planner, which is so funny because I had plans. And here it is, the completely blank slate of the beautiful neutralness of this planner. Oh my gosh, I am so dang excited. So I have my goodies all ready to go here, my weather and my kit. This week I am using Planner Kate Kit 148, just this sampler page. Uh, I think this is last year's, but I like it because you guys know that I'm obsessed with the checklist stuff. So, oh my gosh, here we go. Finally, first plan with me of the new planner. All right, you guys. Oh my word. So I had a suggestion. I don't have all my stuff out because I don't have my cutter and my tweezers. I had a suggestion from one of my class videos to zoom in a little closer than I have been. So 
I hope that um, everything stays in the screen. And I'm missing my, where's my other ruler? Goodness gracious. Okay, so hopefully you guys can see everything and everything stays in the frame. So, okay, I'm gonna get started with doing washi a completely different way than I have ever done it before because that's what I've been looking forward to with not having to cover anything up. Eek, I love it. Okay, I'm not covering up the dates. We're gonna try and see if this fits up here. Oh yeah, that just adds just enough there. <laughs> There's gonna be a lot of excited sounds coming from me during this because I have been looking so forward to this. I've been looking so forward to this. As I'm sure like a lot of us have been. I don't wanna push too hard because I don't wanna like push into the, cut into the planner page. I have to learn how hard to push. Okay, there's that one. Oops, there I go. I figured I would go star, the stars on the left and the stripes on the right because, you know, stars and stripes. And I know I'm gonna cover up the Independence Day over here. That's really okay, because I know it's Independence Day and I'll put something else there. Although I just realized, I don't know if I have anything that just is marking Independence Day. Hmm. I'll have to find it. Actually, I like 4th of July better than Independence Day. I cannot remember who, whose video I was watching. I think it might have been Monarch Plans, who was um, talking about how Independence Day truly was not um, independence for all Americans because during that time there was still some slavery going on and that is a very, very good point. And so I like, I really like Fourth of July, the saying Fourth of July anyways rather than Independence Day. Okay, these are some cool Peloton workouts that I wanna do this week so I'm gonna mark those ones. I am not covering up the calendar. See if I'm, yeah, I am not covering this up. I'm going to do some different stuff. I know you'll see a lot of people cover that up. I am not going to. I've done enough covering up of that <laughs> that section um, and that other planner, and I'm just excited to be able to have some more room. So I'm just going to put this over here, and let's start adding all the fun stuff in Tuesday. It's a trash day. Guys, I'm so excited to finally be able to like sort of utilize this area up here above the days because I had to redate so much that it took up a lot of that space and now I get to use it. Okay, so here is my day off sticker here. definitely want to do I don't want things to get too crowded over here there's my this week Boxes. If I'm getting too like redundant here, like same old, same old, you guys have got to got, let me know. And um, I do have some other things that I am going to be trying out. I kind of am just getting into my groove here with 
how I use things the way I like to use them. Mark my weather. I was hoping to mark my weather a little bit different. Hmm, actually let's use some washing. I feel like I have been waiting forever and a day to be able to finally get into this planner, which is so funny. I mean, I got this planner. I mean, I actually pushed the order button on May 1st. <laughs> so I ordered this planner long before all of the um, let's, shall we say all of the bad decisions, um, were made by certain planner people <laughs> causing lots and lots of people to abandon a specific brand of planner. And, um, I just wanted to let you guys know my stance on it. I was gonna do a separate video before I um, put any more videos out, letting you guys know um, what the plan is for this channel and what I'm gonna be using. Um, honestly, things have sort of changed a bit when it comes to that, because I sort of to a little something I've been eyeing for. Oh my gosh, that is so stinking cute. I love it. Um, so basically, what I was gonna tell you guys is I am not um, an affiliate of any kind. I haven't been sent any free product or anything like that. Um, so I am trying to use what I have. That being said, I have a little something else on its way to me, but uh, you know. <laughs> So um, uh, this year, it took a lot of thought for me, and I just realized that, um, it took a lot of thought for me, and then I you know, went back and forth as far as which planner I wanted to do, and um, is it really worth the money spending, and blah, 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 before I decided on using this planner, and so, I'm gonna to continue to use this, um, but I am not going to be linking um, anything to the Erin Condren brand. Um, I know that there has been some communication sent out lately, and the uh, CEO of the company, you know, um, Erin Condren, has been put on leave of absence, or she took a leave of absence, um, and the company has been, you know, you try and separate the decisions made from one individual from the actual company. Um, but, and if you don't know what I'm talking about, you can um, just Google Aaron Condren graduation and it's, it's all there. It's been talked about by, you know, basically everyone. Um, so I'm not going to go over that, but I am trying to use what I have. And so that may change um, in the future. I have been really looking forward to this planner. Now that I have a little something else on the way, I'm really looking forward to that one, but that'll be shared later too. Um, but I'm really trying to figure out how I can use my stuff basically. All right. And put my little weekend sticker down over here. So anyways, that's, that's that for this channel. There's gonna, um, there's gonna be some, some new stuff coming in for you guys to, for me to show you guys and, um, share with you how I'm gonna use it and 
I really intend on staying with one planner for the year. That's my intention. Now, eek. hopefully, hopefully I can make that happen. So, okay, I'm loving this, loving this so far. I gotta put my meetings in here. to be, I can't write and talk at the same time. Sorry. Okay, so our office is reopening, meaning, meaning I have to go back to working in the office. So I have basically Monday and Tuesday working from home and then I gotta go back to work in the office, which I am totally bummed about, but it is what it is. Um, it has been absolutely amazing being able to work from home. I mean, it's been <laughs> so amazing. You guys know, I think I've been, you know, letting everyone know how much I've enjoyed working from home. Okay, there's my meetings. I really wanna try. <clears throat> Mark that that's the first day back in the office. I really don't think that this one really goes with the whole color scheme of the, everything. Hmm. All right. Um, let's see which one is that? That's blue. Okay. That kind of runs ran together, but <laughs> oh well. All right, eight thirty because that's when I start work. I'm gonna move it up just a smidge. Actually, I don't think I want it down at eight thirty. I think I want it up higher because you know I'm gonna have to get up a little bit earlier and get my butt in gear. <laughs> so let's put it up here. And I think this time my lines for work are going to be solid lines rather than dashed lines. Trying to, oh, nope, did it 30. Just trying something, something a little different. structure to the day. Well, it's going to use some of those bigger. Okay, good. I still have those. You guys, <laughs> I know I seem like I'm all over the place and I'm sorry. I apologize for that. Planner being kind of unplanned. It's not the oxymoron. Okay, so there's my work hours. I really want to do social media down here. I think what I'm going to do, got some more skin washi. I hope I don't have too many different patterns going on here. That's my only fear. I want to do blue, but it's also like there's blue right here. And I really like this pattern. I really like that one, so I'm just going to go with that one. I 
don't know if I should do it above the line or like right on. Okay, I'm gonna do it right here. This is my first time using this skinny washi, I think, in my planner. So that's fun. Um, there we go. I'm just so excited to be able to just lay stuff down and not have to cover it up. I mean, that is a, it was fun and an awesome way to kind of trial things out and see how I wanted to do things. I'm just gonna set this off to the side because I keep moving it around the page. And um, that was great for that purpose, but whoosh, boy did that get old. All right. Now I can use this, like put stuff wherever. Now I have to cover things, try to cover things up. So much fun. It started off as a really gloomy day today, but it's actually looking pretty nice. All right. So down here, I need to do a lot better with, um, consistently posting on Instagram and getting my videos up on YouTube. I don't know, I've got some things coming, so I have some videos that I wanna do when that stuff comes, so I don't wanna mark when videos are gonna be going up, but I do want to mark um, Instagram. I think that's what I'm gonna do down here. So I'm just, just gonna use these little dots. I'm gonna start with the red. And come here. All right. These are gonna be my Instagrams. Hopefully, I can get into a rhythm with posting this on there. If you guys do not um, follow me on Instagram, I will leave my Instagram handle in the description so you guys can check that out if you so wish. That would be awesome. Um, I switched over to, I had a, a different um, Instagram account and switching over to be more um, aligned with the channel. So. That. I'm super excited about the long weekend coming up. Although, hello, that guy wanted to come with me. Although, I I thought we were getting. Sometimes we have like floating holidays, and I don't know why I thought we were doing like um, adding it on to have the like the Thursday and Friday before, and we've done that in the past at my work, but we decided on a different a different day for the floater this year. I totally forgot about that. But my husband has Friday and Monday off. And I'm like, dang, dude, that's awesome. So. Okay. Making sure I got my little notes taken care of. All right, so this I wrote down because some of these classes are lives on Peloton. If you don't know Peloton, you can do um, live classes, but you can also do the ones that are on demand. And so they have this all for one um, sort of series going on for these different ones. And so I'm going to mark those in my planner using, I only have two of these big boxes. So I wonder if I have any, any of these little freebies that have the bigger labels that might work. Because I need three of them. I think all I had are the little thin guys. Okay, well that's okay, that'll work. So, this one, and I like to, when something is happening on Wednesday, um, in order to keep from having to write against the coil, I like to write on my label before I stick it down. It's a tip, tip from me to you. So this is, So 
So this one is a ride um, on the bike, um, a spin bike, a spin class basically. That's a 45 minute ride. And then they have the cool down. So on this series, because you know everyone has to be social distance and things right now, um, they're doing the the warm up and the cool down are live, but the actual class has already been um, it's on demand, so it's it'll be different. Um, I haven't actually done live classes for a while, so but I need to make sure I'm on it at time. This is going to be a scramble. It being my first first day back in the office and then I've got that going on um, and I also have that online book study happening Bible study I think this is the last week for that And my son has, a, he does have a wrestling practice sometime this week, but we're not sure when. And of course, if it happens during the day when I'm back in the office, someone else is going to have to pick him up and take him, unfortunately. All right, so that class is done. Let's see, this one because I'm, I just put, totally put that on the wrong day. That is hysterical. Okay, so at least it's a sticker that you can take off and I didn't write it directly into my planner. Whew, that's on the second, not the first. There we go. I think that looks better anyways. There was a lot of red going on right there. <laughs> Okay, so that was the second. Now we'll move it on to the third, which is the yoga. And my daughter likes to do the yoga classes with me. And actually my, my nine-year-old son does too. All right, and this one is 11. So if you guys, anyone else is a Peloton, person and you are doing these all for one workouts we'll be doing it together hmm, I had a room for the warm-up form up I don't really know how you really need to warm up on, on yoga but it's a thing yoga flow. This isn't really something I do often, but it's part of this all for one thing. So then there's a five minute meditation at the end, because you don't really have to do a cool down for yoga. Okay, so that is at 11. strength one, but I don't have a box that's big enough to go through the whole thing. So, I have to be a little creative here. I think I might, hmm. <laughs> I just needed one more thick box. That's all I needed, but it's not on the kit. Okay. And red. It starts at noon.
is right. Uh, square one, strength. There we go. That's what that one is going to be. That's all of my stickies. All right. So now you guys know that I like to do any cleaning house projects on the weekend. Usually I put it on Saturday, but I think this time I'm going to put it over here on Sunday. Not really house projects, but like cleaning. My little clean house sticker here. Whatever little jobs I don't get done during the week, I do on the weekend. That one's a little crooked. Okay. And I'll put my little check box over here. Let's see, maybe I will. Oop, geez, that check box is crooked. Oh my word. Okay. I kind of have to put it out a little bit so that it actually covers the times. I think that's a little high. Just a smidgy bit. There we go. And I feel like it's crooked again. <laughs> there we go. Okay. So. <laughs> All right. Um, those are some of my workouts here. Oh, weather. I need to do the weather. I'm going to do the weather a tiny bit different this time because, because I'm going to put it in the middle and actually put, okay, I'll show you guys. So it looks like kind of partly sunny each of the days. Okay, I'm going to use this one. centered here I don't know if I moved it or not <laughs> okay this one I feel like they're all towards the left that's so funny giving myself more room to write on the right I guess and Wednesday so much easier to do when it's all folded up especially when it's at the beginning of the planner workouts in up here um, general, generally when I'm working in the office uh, I would wake up really early like I during the school year would get up at 4 30 and do do my workout Gosh, well, I don't know why it still looks like it's way over to the left my word Okay, uh, okay, I'm, I'm giving up. Anyways, I would get up at 4.30 in the morning to get downstairs and get a workout in. And since working from home, I have been very, very lax in that. But I'm just taking full advantage of being able to <laughs> not have to get up super early. I mean, I report, I start working the same time I normally would, but you know how it is. So anyways, if it's also, if it's nice outside, you know, I'll do walks and things like that with the family rather than um, doing workouts in the morning. I do kind of like how working out in the morning makes me feel though. Okay. So, All right, I think for now, 
that is gonna be it. Um, I really wanna put some habit trackers over here because I'm all about tracking habits. But my habit trackers, I did order some, but they have not made it to me. So, um, so I'll probably add those in once they do come. And I think that is going to be it. I don't have any paydays. I do wanna add a little, this just seems kind of one note over here and you guys know I love my icons so okay that's it you guys that's my first plan with me in the new um, the first week of my new 2020 2021 for July you know July through June planner oh my gosh I love it it's different than what I've been doing a little bit it still has the same kind of stuff but yeah I'm super excited for how this turns out. So if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up for me. If you are not already a subscriber, go ahead and click that red subscribe button. I'd be very appreciative of it. If you are a subscriber and you have not already done so, click the notification bell. That way you know when my videos are uploaded. I hope you guys have a wonderful week and I will talk to you guys again next time. Bye guys.